Hi guys, in this video we're going to be making little knives for cupcake toppers um, with the lead up to Halloween. So for this all you're going to need is a toothpick to give the knife stability, a tiny bit of light grey fondant for the blade, a little bit of black fondant for the handle and some food colouring and I'll use a knife to, to basically size the blade. So we'll start off with rolling the light grey into a cylinder because we'll be inserting the toothpick in. We'll decide the length of our blade. Okay, that looks about right to me. We need to keep some out for the, the handle. Okay, so I'm going to flatten out the blade Give it an edge and then I'm going to cut off the excess because I want it to look like a knife. Once we've done that, we're going to flatten out slightly further, clean it up. I've chosen things that you can do easily at home, quick and easy, and doesn't require a lot of tools. That way it's not going to be expensive if you're just starting out. A little bit of black fondant for the handle and insert it on. Okay. As simple with that is we want to shape the handle. so. The handle will automatically have a little finger guard. So we're going to push this in to make a finger guard and extend the handle out. No right or wrong, so you can go with whatever you want. And simple as that, we've got ourselves a little knife. Now given the fact that it's Halloween, I'm going to add a bit of blood. So just some red food colouring. I've tried the gel, but I found with the gel it doesn't dry, so it actually just makes a sticky mess. So all I'm going to do is just add a little bit of colour to my finger, and I'm going to run my finger down the blade, just like so, and then bring it up on either end. You can add as much blood or as little blood as you want. If you had a brown handle, you could add blood to the handle. But there we have our little cupcake knife. 